everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. I'm your host, Super John Gola, and today I'm going to be doing another Call of Duty live commentary here playing some Call of Duty Black Ops 3. And for today's live commentary, I'm actually going to be trying to get some more wins when it comes to my Grand Slam contract over here in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So as you can see, I don't have that many wins, and that's just because I don't really play Black Ops 3 too much anymore. So yeah, let's actually see if maybe we can get up to 5 or 10 wins for today's video. Also guys, if you're enjoying it don't forget to leave a like comment down below let's see if we can get 10 likes on today's video that would be absolutely amazing and yeah let's get right into the video so as you can see guys we actually got a team deathmatch game here on gauntlet and i'm not quite sure what gun i'm going to be using however yeah i'll go and see when i actually load into the game and yeah i'm going to be cutting out this commentary and the gameplay until the game actually loads up so yeah see you then so yeah guys i'm going to be using the cuda for today's video and yeah as you can see i have dark matter on it, it actually looks really nice nice and yeah let's see if we can actually get our first kill and oh there's a guy over here and i uh, just got killed by the razorback however that's not too big of a deal let's move over here and maybe see if we can kill some people by shooting them in the back oh my goodness they're all over there i think i'm gonna go and leave that area and that's just because they all look very angry and they don't like me shooting at them so and there we go we actually got our first kill so yeah recently i have not been playing that much black ops 3 and it's kind of a shame because i do want to get some of the dlc weapons because in this game although i am a prestige master i really don't have that many weapons i have the ffar the hg40 as well as the rsa interdiction and let's go and pick up this xmc my luck when it comes to dlc weapons isn't really that great i'm not like those people that actually get like five dlc weapons in three supplies drops and they have all of them but no i'm not really that person however this xmc is actually really good and the cool thing about this xmc and that's it looks a lot like the black ops 2 oh whoa there we go there we go okay okay he's in the corner actually looks a lot like the uh msmc back in uh call of duty black ops 2 they did a really good job remaking it and holy cow guys we actually got quite a few kills as well as we were actually able to use the an 94 and i think this guy that's playing on the other team yeah i think it's that uh level 800 guy he has a lot of the new dlc weapons i mean he was running around with the xmc as well as then he was using the kvk and it's just crazy Okay, that's actually the first second. And yeah, that was actually my first two kills that I ever got with the Bushwhacker. And actually, this Into the Void camo actually looks a lot like um, Dark Matter. And I know like a bunch of videos were made on it talking about how Into the Void looks better than Dark Matter. And there we go. This guy on the other team has all of these dlc weapons i mean now i just saw that guy has the galil which is absolutely crazy and uh this game we're actually pretty tied uh it's getting close i mean we're just losing just just a little bit and the only thing that kind of sucks right now and that is where i'm actually recording this video is actually very hot however i cannot turn on the fan or anything like that because that would just destroy the audio quality and it will have this very annoying humming in the background and that's just something that i really do not want so that guy is just bouncing everywhere and uh look it's the same guy now he's using the hlx4 which is just crazy all right maybe we can actually get a kill with the specter and we're actually doing very very well i mean it's a very stark comparison between this video and the uh video that i made on advanced warfare because when in advanced warfare i was doing really bad however for this video i'm actually doing somewhat well and i'm not sure how many games i'm actually going to be playing but hopefully we actually are able to win this game and there we go we just got a ripper kill and uh yeah let's use this m1911 Wow, this thing's actually really good. I never used the M1911, and I don't have it, but man, this thing is awesome. But yeah, I know this may sound a bit random, but I would like you guys to comment down below what is your favorite Call of Duty game, because this game right here, Black Ops 3, is probably my favorite. Um, I put the most time into this game out of all the Call of Duty games, and 
If it wasn't for Black Ops 3, I'd probably say my second favorite would have to be Black Ops 1. In my opinion, I think the campaign in Black Ops 1 was absolutely crazy. It was awesome and I really did enjoy it. Now we're actually going to be using the NX Shadow Claw and there we go. We actually got our second kill with it. And the awesome thing about this lobby is that since that person on the other team has a ton of the new DLC weapons, I'm actually able to just pick them up and use them. Like, I barely ever used the HLX4 before. I know that kind of rhymed. I'm just gonna leave that guy alone because apparently he is better than our entire team combined. So yeah guys, unfortunately I'm going to have to cut off this live commentary really soon and that's just because I did actually have some problems with the audio of the live commentary that you're watching right now. So I'm going to be ending off this video right now. So yeah, that's really been it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and if you did, please remember to leave a like as well as subscribe if you're new. Also guys, if you're interested for more Call of Duty live commentaries from me, I would highly recommend that you go and check out yesterday's video which was a live commentary while I was playing Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. I would highly recommend that you go and check out that video, but yeah. That's been it for this video. I hope to see you in the next one.